And welcome back. This is Kota. Hope you all had a good week. And we are back for a another War Rights event. This is a TSA on this Friday. And it is, as everybody spawns in, an Anderson's counterattack. 269 on the server pump, 138 on the CSA versus 131 on the Union team. They are live at 43, so we'll look at these two teams kind of quickly here. So we have on the Union team the second U.S. Sharpshooters um, under Legion Brook. See, then we have the NYV under Sergeant Frog. The 4th West Virginia under Colonel Lightburn. The 2nd U.S. under Major Nightbreeze. 19th Indiana under Ironheart. The 42nd uh, PA under Captain Hood and Mr. Kilroy. The 79th New York Highlanders under Mr. Ricks. The 9th Corps under Commissar. And Mr. Knight leading the 8th PA. Alright, so now we'll take, take a look at the CSA team. They have HL under KMGG. And we've got HD under Major Rob. Down. First Tennessee Down. under Mr. Large. Down. Then we got fourth Georgia here under Major Clarkie. Good to see him in there again. We've got PB under Death Silence. KB under Mr. Disco. First VA under Mr. Connor. And 20th Georgia. Georgia, excuse me, under Hellhammer. And SR under Tongray is in here as well. I think uh, I missed him somewhere. Team is Tall Gray on. Mr. Tall Gray is on the Union team. All right, I just missed him. But off we go at the 43, and it looks like the Union is going to opt for a forward defense, at least initially, sending several units forward here, and maybe to uh, we'll see if they hold or if they're just going to try to stack them up a little bit. And the Pathfinders under the Fourth West Virginia here are the first ones to move out. This direction. Looks like they got a lot of support, though, from several other units. It's like 19th Indiana and the NYV are also heading out in this forward direction. I think uh, 4th West Virginia will be the first play. unit in engagement. Steady! Take aim down the line. Steady. Aim low. Aim low. Fire! Brian putting off an initial shot. I'm kind of curious to see if the Union will stay in this forward defense or if they'll give ground here. <laughs> oh, oh, I see them. North, north, moving north, east. North, north, east. Left side. There's a whole line north. North, north, lads. Look north. Look north. So, like, a lot of Union starting to join them up here. You got Knight up here now along with 9th Corps. NYV off to the side a little bit. So, a very forward defense here. By the CSA team here. Kind of zoom out here and we kind of see how far forward the Union actually is. Again, this is kind of rare for the uh, Union team, at least uh, that I've seen in this event. We'll see how it works out here. KMG, boys, come on. Left face, HL, we're moving out, KMG, let's go. It's like HL, KMG, KMGG is going to attempt to flank. And he's going to run fire, into right Mr. Frog right here, Aiming, who has one of the most distinct voices in this game, west. in my opinion. Independent fire, boys. I'm going to try and get... Right drift. And so far, the NYV is holding strong there. Keep firing, boys. Keep firing. Keep shooting right into them, boys. Nolan, this moonshine tastes like a... Like a bot. We got the RB as well, another uh, newly formed unit Thanks. under Mr. Disco. Alright boys, get behind this hard cover here. Get behind the hard cover. Turn left. Very close fight here on the shooting. Now we do have... Looks like the CSA has kind of broken off a lot of contact and are starting to move over to the Union. Uh, left CSA right here pushing up, and they have a pretty good opportunity here to possibly outflank the outflank of the Union. I can't, God, I've been can't talk all fucking day. I've been talking like shit. Um, 
Oh, it, they did uh, trying to get this cannon crew back here. Some of uh, Ninth Corps. SR kind of guarding them as well, along with Ricks. Uh, so far, they're unopposed on this side, though. We'll see. Union seems to be anchored on this right here. 19th, do you see the company in front of you? We got eyes from here. And we got some movement here. HL is going to make a bit of an advance here. Line, Once more line. against the NYV. Uh. Oh, a We're devastating go, volley go, by the go, HL. All the bucket ball has done has basically broken the, the NYV. But the 19th Indiana, sensing danger, has charged in and has gotten behind the HL. This could be a key maneuvering here from the 19th Indiana. Second U.S. also in there as well, aiding them, I should say. And they have aided the NYV in what would have been a dangerous position. Well done to the 19th Indiana. Again, though, you can see the main story is the CSA is advancing forward on this CSA right union left side of the field here without much opposition at all. Um, you have some skirmish elements out here. Uh, like 4th West Virginia is now rotated out here. Uh, for the moment, um, really not too much engagement. CSA with a bit of a ticket lead right now. We'll see if that continues. Union is really pressing on this forward defense on this uh, Union right side here. See, the CSA is starting to inch forward here. It might start eating these small units and getting some really good out-of-line kills here. Like this right here is wonderful down? kills for the uh, CSA team. No. Getting these out-of-lines like this. See, 4th West Virginia has been pushed back and you got... Small little elements here that's going to be really, uh, detrimental. Ticket balance. You can see the Union starting to fall back pretty significantly on tickets. And the CSA is trying to inch a cap, but they're not committing to it. Um, so I think this is fine for now, to be honest with you. I mean, I, I, I always am kind of cool with the early cap, but... Um, you don't have to. You feel like you're doing a decent pace, and you know, at this rate, they're they're at a decent pace. But we do have some movement over here. Who is this? Fire boy. Ooh, Fire. hell of a volley Fire. coming Fire. in by 42nd and 8th Pennsylvania. Um, we'll see if the HD and First VA can meet them in time. I think they need a little bit more support than what they've got, to be honest with you, for the Union. Hold the rocks. Hold here. Hold here. Do they have additional help? They do. Here comes the Ninth Corps into the flank here to take off some of that pressure from the intercepting some of the HD. That might be just enough. And that will stabilize yeah, that front. Like There's still a pretty significant... For well, not too significant. they got 20th Georgia up here. And Mr. Hellheimer. And you've got, uh, I believe this is 4th Georgia. 4th Georgia, Fourth West Virginia behind them. I think 4th Georgia's in this event, too, and I haven't seen them. But look what's happened over here. I didn't see this. Um, but HL and the RB and others, I think PB's in here as well, have wiped out these elements over here. Have now secured this side of the field. Um... That's going to be a bigger problem, I think. Um, because, again, you haven't wiped out the full CSA contingent over here, but now you've given up this side of the field here. Um, that might be a bigger problem for the Union. We will see. Again, there's no uh, outside communication. There's no steam chat or anything um, in this event. So, you know, communication is, is difficult. So these guys might not even be aware that 
This is all hostile in front of them. You can see CSA starting to move forward here. I will protect you, baby. Head to the edge of the woods. Run, baby. Run. Run. I got you. HPA leads the fucking way. We led that charge like a bunch of chances. And you see HL is now kind of moving into this strong position, trying to isolate the 42nd from any support coming from Maine. I think it's a good positioning for them there. And you still have pressure from the 20th, Georgia, over here on these small out of lines that are just devastating as from a ticket perspective. The Union. Ninth Corps cleaning up a few out of lines itself, but they got to be careful not to get out too overstretched here. They don't have a lot of troops either, so they can easily get sucked, you know, wiped out by one of these bigger formations. And in fact, here we got a charge here by the HL against the 42nd and 8th PA, and that will eat them pretty damn easily. And the Union is losing position after position here, and the CSA is doing a pretty damn good job of it so far. Yep, we'll have to see. Now the Union is kind of masked up on this left side. Okay, hold. Which uh, I never like to be in because I feel like it always just kind of pushes you back to main and gives you no options to maneuver. So I would try to break out fo either forward and attack this unit here before reinforcements come up, which might be too late already, or cross the field and move back over here. But I, I hate getting stuck in this position here. You just lose slowly, in my opinion, but... Uh, I, this already is stupid to me, in my opinion. It's you just asking for out of lines. You're never going to really do that much damage anyway. Might get one fuck you shot off, but. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that bounce that came back. <laughs> Got my point. More rifles! It could be used right now, but, you know. See, again, I, I agree with Frog. Try to get back out on this other side. Second U.S. going with him. 19th Indiana going with him. I hate fighting over this side. I mean, you can leave, like, a unit like Northwest Virginia, like Lightburn, to kind of just try to tie down some bigger units. But, um, God, Rick's... Oh. And second U.S. is doing the same thing. There's, there's no... You're not defending anything. You're not really, you know, securing anything. You're just giving away out-of-line tickets right now. Especially the way they're formed up. This is just poor. You can say that's me talking shit. No, I'm, you know, if you disagree with me and say this is good, let me know the rationale for why this is good. My view is you kill a guy in line, you lose one ticket. No, you get killed out of line, you lose five. and You have a lot less tickets as a defender, so... Like, are you really denying a position here? No, you're just getting farmed. Oh, we're shooting him. Okay. Count how many times you get killed. Like that guy just there. At least a skirmishing. And there's engaged. Getting already shot, not really killing too many, and those that killed are formation. Oh. Teeth at the end of getting nailed by who was this? RB. And some others. Oh, see, here's a problem. You had some falling back, you had some going forward. Pick your choice. And they took the flag with a big mistake. Alright, good. Commissar's pulling him back. Good move by him. Not getting too overextended there. Yeah, 30 minutes. Uh, Union at engaged. CSA still battle ready. They've got... Zoom out here and you can see they've got the right side of the field and they've got the left side of the field. They can push on point whenever they choose to. They, it's it's their field at the moment. So 
even on the uh, side, so. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Go, go, go. Yeah, that's a big line. CSA would say just needs to continue shaping the battlefield like they're doing right now, hemming in the Union more and more, farming the outer lines. And, you know, if anybody gets deep, you know, you, you hit them hard like they've been doing. Union, you need to concentrate and hit somewhere to regain some... Uh... Oh, we got a big charge here. Oh, this would be a big wipe for the CSA. It's three flags here. Yeah, you run, bitches. Oh. They're not doing a good job getting out of there. There's one flag down, there's two flags down. CSA is pulling back, but they've, they've met the... Well, they've, they've done what they've needed to. Look at how much damage they've done to the tickets, and you've lost two flags. And now you're stuck out on this island and don't have any maneuver space again. CSA is just constricting the Union more and more. We'll zoom out so you can kind of see it. It's more and more just circling around them and putting them out in shitty positions. You know, okay, you're exchanging fire over here. This does nothing. This works for the CSA. Why? Because you still got this here to form. And you're going to, again, over here, okay, what are you going to do? Come out and get your flags? No, you're going to come out and run here, and I'm going to snipe you as you do it. Cannon comes in, doesn't hit anything. Thank you. CSA has now gone to engage at uh, the 27 minute mark, but look at the Union. Halfway down. This is great for the CSA. It's a tough map, but, um, you know. There's a lot of things the Union are doing that are really hurting them. Like this right here. What do you what, what, mm. I mean, okay, maybe you're going to get another angle, but if you get caught out, a lot of tickets you're going to give away. Interesting. The CSA's pulling back. I would have stayed there. Just continue to shoot it out. I think you can win it. I think the gun might have a little recoil. Yeah, it does a little bit. <laughs> See, look at this. I mean, they're not even in really cover. They're getting shot from two angles here. Get that flag up. Get that flag up. Full line to the east, gentlemen. Full line to the east. Ooh, wow. Georgia flag. flag. Georgia flag. Somebody grab that thing. Yeah. Interesting that the CSA is capping now. I would stay off cap, and I believe it's those folks up there. I got it. That could be a critical mistake that might let the Union back into this match. They've got a pretty strong force assembled here now, and they've been able to recover the flags again. I, I don't know why the CSA pulled off. I would have stayed there. And at least farmed them for a little bit longer until those flags disappeared. But I, I can't believe the CSA is capping right now. Is, this, is it intentional? Maybe? I, I guess. I'm trying to think why it would be... You, you're doing good on casualties. You're doing okay on time. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. I, I would agree. Yes.
Fuck, fuck. 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 Stand by. We'll see what the Union does from here. Um. They've gotten a unit back over to the woods here, at least two units actually. 19th and 9th Corps. 919. Um. So, like, NYV's moving up to kind of cap while the 42nd is serving as a blocking force along with 4th West Virginia over here. And APA, I should say. Watch him fucking run, boys! Watch him fucking run, PA! And that's what you want to do. You want to do a quick recap uh, to regain the tickets as soon as possible and minimize the damage. So this is a good uh, counter move here by the Union. The CSA, I would, um, well, I'm, I'm, to be honest with you, I'm not sure what I would do. I'm, I don't know why they capped. Hey, web straight uh, west. Uh, would I contest it? You're not really in a position to, to be honest. Um, I might charge in. And, and, and the reason I say that is um, lose as many tickets as you can so they get uh, try to get it back to even. Because you don't want this union to get the uh, advantage back. Listen, listen. Unit Pele, the Fibula. It's the same thing, dude. Pardon me. Okay, man. Come on. Don't hit me. No, dude. I'm telling you. That's how it's going to go down. Parker. Parker. Right out in front of 42nd and 8th. Alright, so the CSA is contesting this. Connor, in fact, is going to come up and try to charge him out here. Again, I think a charge makes sense to me right now. You, you, you know, either, either you contest the point is one benefit and, you know, keep it um keep it going. Or, you know, even if you lose men, whatever right now. You don't want them to uh, get too much on the uh, recap. So it's fine to lose men right now for the CSA. Especially if you can, uh... And if you win, you win. It's great. In fact, here comes HL. Send them back to Richmond! What are you doing, brother? I'll send you back to Washington, you little... boy. It's good control of your language. Very good. You see, now the CSA can charge up here and, and continue pushing them off. And there we go. CSA has a successful charge there. And we'll see if they maintain it. A lot of Union now in the woods that are kind of not fighting at the main uh, piece right now. Which again, any actions you do over there really don't matter right now. Oh, we're killing the enemy. No, all you're doing is killing yourself. What do you mean, Kotel? Well, you see, you got those two bars at the top there of the morale states, and if you win the counterattack, you're going to have the Union bar go back up to the CSA bar. So that means if you make the CSA bar go lower, you get less back. Oh, but what about counterattack? Well, if you don't counterattack, you don't win anyway, so you have to counterattack. You have to retake the point to win at all for the Union now, or you lose automatically. So anything you kill right now actually hurts you. What you need to do is take the point back, while doing the least amount of damage possible to the other team to maximize the amount of tickets you get back. Why do you keep explaining that? Because people still fucking don't do it. Oh, we're killing the enemy. You, you. We have a company in the woods. So fill the gap. And we have a, um, more, more people coming in. We'll just hold here until the rest of our company shows up. Yeah, so again, these guys over here need to figure a way to support the attack on point. Back to who is this? It's 19th and 9th Corps, if I remember right. Yep, and 4th West Virginia as well. I mean, cover the man getting flagged, so don't really have a huge problem with that. See, now the CSA is dug in like a tick, so it looks like the CSA has opted to try to hold points, or at the very least, to make the uh, Union pay 
Norrently Fort, which is the uh, right move in my point, in my view. Load back behind the rocks, behind the rocks, behind the rocks. Moving out, A2, there go. Yeah, this works out well for the CSA. If they can keep the Union distracted, doing these stupid volleys that don't really do anything. It's great. Check. Check. Same position, to game. Down the line. Steady. Fire. Hey man! Hey boys doing? We uh, wouldn't have to take that. Wow. Pull back to reload, pull back to reload. Pull back, pull back, pull back. Pull back. Hey, fuck you, that's taking my heart. So looks like the at least part of the Union is starting to move to point, but I don't know if this is enough here. You still have a another element up here, but they need to make sure they're actually fixing these forces here. And if these guys charge, these guys got to be in a position to charge them out. Because um, right now, this is not enough troops here to actually retake point. Now, Lightburn is coming to join him, which is good, but they still need more. And in fact, 2nd U.S. Sharpshooters, or 9th Corps is coming up, which is good. Who else? Yeah. See, it's, it's not enough, though. You're not, you don't have actually have enough here to actually push them off. This element up here is too weighted too much. That element up there. And these guys here, who's his 20th, is doing a great job keeping them 20th and HD, keeping these guys doing wasteful volleys that don't do shit. Uh, oh wait, no, 40 seconds full going right. All over the long yeah, line. Now uh, you do have Up online, boys. this small yeah. element that's moved over here to try to get some flanket fire, maybe to try to dislodge them a little bit. Open order, open order. But again, you know, look, look, look at where we are now in the morale state. CSA is almost down uh, to taking losses. Halt, left phase. And we've only got three minutes remaining. Independent it's still going to take a lot more to retake this point. All right, and now the Union is starting to capture. Put it out, and you're independent, boys. Pour it in, pour it in. Southwest west. Just yeah, again, these elements out here really have to get a twist on and not let these guys get away. And in fact, 19th is starting to move up here. They really, uh, it's going to suck, but you need to keep these guys' attention. You cannot let them move off, which is what they're doing right now. If not, you got to charge them. Yep. Okay, now you need to all go in. And try to hold this point as best you can. Now, this Kilroy element here is kind of chasing them off of the main element here, which is actually working out very well. We'll see if the Union can actually take it. Tiki is your friend. Come on, baby. They're going to suck. Sigma. 
Good attempt to charge there by 8th PA, tying down a lot of units. Yep. And Kilroy's over there kind of doing enough of the distraction here to drag off those units and allow them to recap. Now, this is not ideal. They recapped the 25 at taking losses, but they're still in the game at the very least. So the Union was able to eventually put together an attack here that did succeed, but uh, they are still very much behind the eight ball here. And we will see if they can figure out a way to try and recover this defense. Curious to see what they would do. I would, I would, I would go on a hunting spree. I would all these tiny units just eat them, eat them, eat them, eat them. Defeat in detail and stay mobile. Get positional. Let the let the CSA surround you, and that's fine. And then just eat, 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 eat. And if they cap, great. Try to get them to cap again. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't stay here in this big blob. I again you know, start eating this. And again, you don't want to attack. You don't so. This is not a great angle of attack here, because if you remember from uh, what we were seeing the other time, you're, you're attacking in a direction that gives the enemy a chance to retreat. So like a better angle of attack, you're, you're a little bit vulnerable, but attack up like this. That's how you want to attack. Now, you might be vulnerable to a counterattack over there, but, um, you know, if you do it fast enough, you know, it can work. But, you know, attacking down this way gives the enemy a chance to retreat, so it's not as ideal. Follow me, 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 follow all the way to their big rock. Now, the one danger with this is kind of losing uh, cohesion here. So, actually, at this point, I'd probably pull it back. Um, but you got to be careful of that. I think he's. It, it was good, and now you got to pull it back. And, in fact, that's what he's doing. Lightburn's got to be careful not to stay here, though, because CSA is going to hit this hard. So, I'd, I'd get out of there if I was Lightburn. And, yep, there he goes. He's heading back as well. But the CSA, frankly, doesn't have to rush. They've got plenty of time. They can they can really take their time to shape this fight, find a weakness, and hit it. They don't need to rush at all. Right to left, the last I saw. Oh, don't stay there, Mr. Beef. Did he get out in time? We'll see. He's hanging out. Again, in these very uh, skirmishy and uh, out of line positions. Now, he is on some hard cover, but it is very easy to get uh, knocked out from there with a very big ticket loss, and you really do have to count every ticket on this map. You can see the Union's far fell behind again. You know, it might be just about even, but uh, like this in the center here, I would send a party out and raid this shit. You know, they're going to be strong on the sides. Relatively speaking, they're weak in the center. You don't have to send everything in. You don't have to recap. You send a quick raid party in, quick out. In, out, you know. Oh, we lost some tickets too. Doesn't matter. Check the uh, this other side. Looks like a pretty major attack is developing. Okay, Hood rotates to this side. Interesting. Looks like he's going to have a pretty good angle here on this PBRB element. Although they're going to give their own uh, back in turn. In fact, I think the uh, CSA got the better of that little engagement, to be honest with you. Good hold, good discipline here by these elements here. Disco and... Uh, Sorry, my bird. They're running, boys. They're running. Load and hold, load and hold, load and hold. 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 Load and h
attack. Did they nail the Union flag there? Oh, they did. Very good job. Very good job there by the CSA team. And look at this. We're at 20 minutes and Union's halfway down on taking losses. Oh, he's right here. I'm here. I was still here. I was just on the other side. Damn, our fucking Yankee doodle dandies and put these bitches down. And CSA, just maintain the discipline, maintain the squeeze. Good to go. And like I said, if I was Union right now, I'd. I'd Stay mobile, find weak points, and hit them. Union South! Union South! Union South! Union left! Keep moving! In and charge, charge, man, it's charge. Back, recall, recall. Yeah, CSA got a pretty good twist on the NYV there. On the rocks, on the rocks, on the rocks. Oh, moving quite a bit. I'll try to slow it down a little bit here. Just a lot of action going on, so. I got it. It's on very different sides of the map. Oh, we got a movement forward here by element of HD charging into the ninth core. I don't think they have quite enough here. It's going to work to ninth core's advantage. Come on, hip. Zoo, zoo, zoo. <laughs> Question mark? Was it just Rambos? That's fine. I don't care if it's Rambos. Free tickets. They're wild. And you can see that uh, attack really uh, evened it out here. CSA losing a bit of their uh, ticket advantage. Kind of feeding it in here. Let's see, as that's going on, what else we got? A little long distance fight over here. Yeah, main element's this. You know, the CSA's starting to mess up over here. Now, this is starting to really work to the C. All right, well, now the CSA is really starting to mass here. Now you got Connor moving up. Friendly, friendly, you dumb dicks. Stop it. Quit. Yep, that's going to work out really no, well. Sorry, and you can no, see the Union no, 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 sorry, morale has just uh, plummeted there. Dead officer. And in fact, if they keep this attack up, they should be able to put them onto breaking, and the Union is in not a good position to stop them. The, Union, the CSA should be launching a full attack right now on the center, and they'll win. This charge is in. Oh, I don't know why you're charging over here. Well, I guess you're looking for those last kills, but yeah, Union... CSA just needs to charge center right now. Whatever they got over there. Oh, and losing your opportunity. I mean, you're still in a great position, but. Um. Oh, I don't know why he didn't go in. Great opportunity. Is with me here, you don't know what to do. Dropping them. I can you tell PB that we want to try pushing the point. We're pushing them into breaking and winning this map. I agree with TJ. Like, this is doing a really good job here of kind of keeping them isolated. All you need is a good push. You know, catching these guys and skirmishing and out of lines. Or this element up here skirmishing and out of line. And, and, 
should put them on breaking, and the Union is not in a great position to stop you. The longer you take, the more time Union has to fix the problem, so... You know. In the back, you see Union starting to move elements back down. Oh, your window is closing. Rebels on Hellhammer. We're moving. That's dumb. Looking, looking, looking. Yep, right, 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 right. I nailed that fucking flag. First Virginia, about face, double quick, Mark. About face. Connor's going to pull back a little bit. Maybe he's trying to suck in the Ninth Corps. Ambush them. Oh, these guys broke contact, so that's again going to give the Union time to get into a better position to defend points. I think that was a lost opportunity for, for the CSA. Now you're starting to go, but it's too late, man. You've already took you way too long to get that attack going. Again, there's no steam chat, so it's easier said than done, but... Have sex with these boys. Have sex with these boys. Yeah, yeah. Uh, consensual. Consensual. Get in there, follow Yeah, see this, you know. Five tickets right here. It's huge. There it is. Now the CSA is still in a decent position to uh, hold this. Union needs to uh, stop them. As quickly as possible. Incoming! Sound! 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 That's all the CSA needs to do is hold. Oh, and they won on that side. That'll be it. And that is the end there. CSA had the number. GG, Yank, you lost. Same old story. Different day. I'm not even going to bother repeating. It's all built into the game mechanics. It's not me saying it. It's it's, it's how the game is built. Tickets matter. How you do the counterattack matters. I'm not. It, 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 it's not even a point in me getting into tactics. You know, I'll point them out when I see them. But again, it's, it's these basic gameplay mechanic things that if they don't get done, it doesn't really matter what else you do. You're just gonna naturally lose. Ah. <sighs> anyway. Not the only ones that do it. Other people do it. Overall, still, uh, East and Anderson's. Anderson's a very tough map. Um, Union gave it a decent shake. Uh, CSA played it well. So, we'll see you in the next one.